That was probably a good way to start the video. That was my Terry's chocolate orange. Because I got one today. You're welcome, Alex Day. <laughs> today. T today, Alex Day. Meh. Anyway, um, I saw that in the, the Sainsbury store and I got really excited and I was like, Terry's chocolate orange, we should get that. We should also get some green tea because green tea is my favorite. Oh no, wait, it has lemon in it. Yeah, yeah, I don't like lemon. It tastes like poop. Anyway, I'm going to get more green tea tomorrow, but I still have the bag and I'm still going to put it in my scrapbook because I'm a loser. Um, but anyway, today I woke up late because stupid international phone. The only part that's not stupid about that is that I have Big Ben as a background. Anyway, um, stupid phone. Apparently, when, back up two years, when I was in Spain and the first day, my roommates, I had two roommates, because there were three girls that went, and they were like, Laura, we don't have an international phone. Will you set an alarm for us? And I was like, sure, we don't need to call the hotel for a wake-up call. We'll just use my phone. Oh, wait, I've been using my phone all day. I should charge it. It'll still work. It didn't. It didn't. It didn't again today, because I forgot. Again. <sighs> I woke up at 9.15. Supposed to eat for breakfast at 8.30. Class started at 9.00. 15 people are rapping on my door and I'm like what year is it I don't understand so I try to walk to the door and then they've already left by the time I got to the door and then I was confused and I was like did I make up the wrapping in my mind but I didn't because I found out that someone wrapped in my door earlier or later after that fact I found out who wrapped on my door and I was like thank you because I wouldn't have woken up otherwise and apparently People had called me like four times on my hotel phone, which makes this annoying bleeping noise, really high pitched and everything. I don't know why I would have woken up to that, except for the fact that I was so tired. I had made a video yesterday at like 12 a.m. You'd have known how tired I was. Explain something to you. When I am really, really tired, I cry. It just, it just comes out. I yawn and then I cry. So I was Skyping my parents at like midnight because that was like six for them. Yeah, that's right. Um, and that was when my mom got home. Um, and so we started Skyping at like 11.30 and then by 12 I was like, I've been up for like five days. Except for that wasn't true. But I'd still been up for a really long time and I don't want to figure out the math because time zones freak me out. But I was really tired and I was crying like every two minutes. And they were all like, Laura, what's wrong? And I was like, I'm tired. I want to go to bed. But I want to talk to you. <sighs> anyway. So, anyway, today, after the whole missing a little bit of class, she called me again as I was going to get in the shower. And she was like, oh, Laura, I'm so glad that you're not dead or whatever because she worries because she's a mom. And I felt really bad. She was like, blah, blah, blah. Here is how you get to the conference room where we're having class. Bring a notebook. You haven't missed much. Glad that you're okay. And I was like, I'm glad that I'm okay too. I'm also glad that I'm a freak and I didn't get a wake up call because that's what normal people do. Um, but anyway, I went to class. Class was fine. I wrote a little little journal thing in my, in my nice leather journal. It's all pretty. And then after that, a bunch of us went and we found an ATM machine. And I just wanted to go find the ATM. I didn't really need money. Um, but that was nice to know. It's like across from our hotel. Um, by the way, yeah, there, oh, Family Guy commercial. Anyway, I've been watching, um, um, what is it, Holly Oats? I don't know what that is, some random British TV show, but after that, um, How Many Mother is on. Happy. Do you know, do you notice how I ramble? Yeah, that's because, um, Rachel wanted a video, giving you a video, and... Also, it would probably be nice to look back on this when I'm like 80 and be like, oh, look at me. Look at me, a young 19-year-old in London. Because I want to be living there someday. I mean, here. Not in this hotel room, but like that way. That way to the window. And I still can't show you the view because it's night again. Anyway. Um, but we found the ATM machine. And then a girl named Christina and a girl named Molly and I wandered around and... I found um, a tourist shop where I got a bunch of postcards, and yes, I got a William and Kate one for my friend Megan back at school, who is obsessed with them, dressed up like her for Halloween. 
shiny. Um, anyway, so I'm going to center that. And they had a lot of William and Kate paraphernalia, and I wanted to buy it all because I'm a freak and I like spending money on people more than spending money on myself. But the first thing I bought for myself here, besides the Terry's Chocolate Orange, is Underground. Yeah, that's what, that's what the tube, yeah, yeah, the tube, that's what the subway station is called. The tube. I mean, sure. Anyway, it has like a map of it, um, and there's like Notting, Notting Hill. I didn't know that was in England. Anyway, that's exciting. Base waiter. I don't recognize any of these places. So probably shouldn't use these to find my way home. Um, but yeah. And then we went to the... <sighs> the grocery store and I got Terry's chocolate orange and some clementine clementines which they call tangerines here it's very exciting um and then I bought this tea green tea oh good because Laura likes simple tea Laura doesn't like any flavoring in it with lemon it tastes like beet anyway I'll just give it to my mom um but anyway I'm still gonna keep the package because I'm gonna put it in my scrapbook and by scrapbook, I make that a journal that I that I tape things in. Anyway, um, so yeah, that was today. Oh, I also went to a pub, um, and I got fish and chips, because I like fish. And we were in London, and I wanted to eat fish and chips. Um, so I did that, and I also got a rum and coke, because, um, I don't know, it was like three pound. And I felt like it, and they didn't card me because I look 18, apparently. And that's drinking age in London, in case you weren't aware. Let me just tilt that. I don't know. I don't know framing on this thing. Yeah. Anyway. Um, this is my third time trying to make this video, and I'm really glad that it's seven minutes now, because... You should sit through this, Rachel! One of those postcards is for you. Yeah. I'm gonna send both you and Haley the same one because you live in the same place. Anyway, so I don't know. This was for you. And I'm I'm just chilling in here watching watching Holly Oats on the TV. I don't know what that is, but it's on and they're talking in British accents. And I like it. How I met your mother is on afterwards. I don't know if I already told you because this is the third time me telling this video. Oh, also, put a do not disturb sign on my door, and I come back, and they have disturbed. <sighs> They've cleaned my towels, moved my things, emptied my trash. <sighs> I like my shit to be in the same place. Otherwise, I can't find it. I mean, I suppose it was nice, but... I just don't want people messing with my stuff, because they're going to steal my orange Duluth pack backpack. And then I'm gonna be pissed. I think the limit on YouTube videos is 15 minutes, at least for me. So I'm gonna I'm gonna sit here, and you're gonna like it. Um, what else happened today? By the way, this is my Terry's chocolate orange. I don't know if I showed this to you yet. Third time. Anyway, here's my cherries. <laughs> cherries chocolate orange. Cherry Terry's chocolate orange. Anyway slammed against my desk like 45 times because it does not split like you think it's gonna split it splits like weirdly and it's got orange in it I mean ugh. who saw that coming anyway hope you miss me yeah hope you're excited because I haven't found your gift yet but I'm gonna give it to you eventually should find it I should I should go find Charlie that can be your gift I'll find Charlie oh my tea is cold. I forgot about it. Lukewarm tea with lemon. Oh, the lemon is just gross. I wonder if they have real tea here. What is this? It's marijuana! Just kidding, it's not. Oh, by the way, they were selling condoms um, that had British flags on them in the same place that I bought the socks and the postcards. And I almost got them for my sister, but I didn't because I was embarrassed. Um, and I really hope that they're actually British flags on, like, the actual condom, because that would be funny. Um, but yeah. I don't know. I'm gonna sit around. Oh, oh, How I Met Your Mother is on. I can see it. See it in, actually, this is a mirror. This is my computer. That's the TV. I can see the TV in two different places. Yeah. Ten minute video bar. Done. Anyway, 
that's probably all I have to say for now. Um, I got wireless internet for a week, um, and I don't know, that costs a lot of money, so I'm gonna make, I'm not gonna make her, um, I offered it to one of the people that I traveled with today, I was like, you can come up to my room, and if it works for you to have wireless internet while you're in here, I don't know if it's just my computer or not, um, which would be stupid, because what if there's two people in the room and we both split it, um, but yeah, so she's gonna come up here in a little bit, and I'm gonna Skype my parents, and yeah, then I'm gonna go to bed. And I don't have stuff till 10:30. And then I'm so excited. Such a good time. Um, and then Christina and Molly and I are going to go clubbing Saturday night because we don't have anything Sunday morning. And not that we're gonna get drunk. We're just gonna stay up late. Um, but I think that'll be really fun. And then Sunday is our free day. Um, and so we're gonna like find the Eye of London and find, uh, I don't know, all the places that we didn't go to today. By the way, we went to King's Cross Station, found a little Harry Potter thing, um, and it was really stupid, because we walked in and we were like, okay, it's gonna be between platform nine and platform 10, isn't it? Doesn't that make sense, nine and three quarters? No, it was on platform one, we asked, and they were like, go to platform one. So we went to platform one, we got there, wasn't there, we were like, Where's the Harry Potter thing? And they were like, oh, the Harry Potter thing. Well, that's outside. Go outside. And we were like, good. Thanks for thanks for making us already buy a ticket to go in to Platform 9. And another ticket to go into Platform 1. And then no ticket to go outside. You could have just told us that at the beginning. <sighs> I'm not frustrated. Anyway, it was this really stupid little, like, divot of brick outside the stupid nine and three quarters thing and there was like those metal gate things up it was stupid i feel like if they had actually made it like part of king's cross station and had like a little souvenir shop and like a place where you could buy the books because i still want to find all the harry potter books and buy them in the actual uk oh i also have to buy john green's book read john green he's awesome yay Shameless plotting. Plotting. What is it? What is it called? Shameless. Something. I don't know. Plugging? I don't know. Anyway. Um. I don't know. That's my life. That's my life right now. Really happy in London. I'm gonna move here. And I'm going to eat Terry's chocolate oranges every day. Except for not, because I'm not really a big fan of them. Um, but I'm gonna drink green tea, no lemon, every day. I'm gonna watch Doctor Who, and I'm gonna walk around, and yeah, it's gonna be great. Oh, another by the way, I gotta ask for directions today. I mean, <laughs> it was at the point where we were all lost, and by the way, we missed the other group thing where we went to the British Museum. We missed meeting people outside the hotel to go to the British Museum. Um, and cause we got lost. We didn't know which street our hotel was on. We knew the avenue it was on, but, I mean, avenues are long, and if you don't know the cross street, there's really no way to get there. So we were like, St. Giles Hotel? Anyone know where it is? And they were like, no, because it's, I mean, it's a big hotel, but it's not like, like a really, really well-known hotel. So no one knew where it was, and we were just wandering around, and then... While we were wandering around trying to find the hotel, already 20 minutes late to meet everyone, um, this, this woman comes up to me and she's like, excuse me, do you know how to get here, blah, blah, blah. And I was like, I'm lost. I don't know if you can't tell this by the, on my face, but you should be able to. Anyway, I'm almost going to reach 15 minutes. I don't know why I have so much to say about today, but I do. I keep remembering things that happen. <sighs> anyway. I don't know. You're not supposed to have pauses in videos, according to Hank and John. But I did. Here's another pause. Deal with it. Anyway, that's probably all. Oh, I knew I framed this weird, because I started slouching. <sighs> anyway. Rachel, I put pictures on Facebook. Look at them. There's only, like, 40 of them now. There will be more. I will meet David Tennant. I will find him. I will ask him how his wife is. I will find Alex Day. And I will be like, you are awesome. I love you. Except for I don't really love you. I love your music because I don't know you yet. Yet. I don't know you yet. You're just really dumb. 
find you on the street. I will come up to you. Oh, wait, look. It's me getting really excited. <sighs> Today was a good day. Today was a really good day. And tomorrow's gonna be awesome too, because we get the night off tomorrow. And we're gonna go see Wicked. Except for maybe not. I mean, I saw a poster of it somewhere and I was like, I wanna see Wicked. And Christine was like, I wanna see Wicked. And I was like, oh, let's do it. But I don't know if we're actually gonna see Wicked because it probably costs like a million dollars. Anyway, 1535, go me. It's probably the most boring video you've ever listened to. I'm not a vlogger. I mean, I am.